Lane Christensen, we drill deep to access the Earth's natural resources. Water, energy, and minerals that add to the quality of lives around the world. As a global leader tackling difficult jobs, our primary focus always remains on our planet's greatest resource, our people. Hello, I'm Andy Schmidt, President and CEO of Lane Christensen. Founded in 1882, our company was built on the ingenuity and muscle of America's true drilling pioneers. And today we continue to thrive with a legacy of overcoming obstacles, facing challenges head on. Our diversified service company focuses on four primary sectors, water resources, energy, mineral exploration, and geoconstruction. Whether the job is in Arizona, or Africa, or Afghanistan, we set high performance standards, not only for the job, but also for the safety of everyone involved. From proposal to completion, from the Earth's resources to human resources, Lane Christensen is working in the green zone. At Lane, working in the green zone is not a mere catchphrase or corporate slogan. It is our culture. It guides our decisions and sets the clear standard for all to achieve. So what does working in the green zone really mean? Here are some key members of Lane Christensen's team to tell you more. At Lane Christensen, when you're working in the green zone, You've moved yourself and your team into the best and safest working conditions possible. On every job, on every continent, Lane Christensen employees are instructed to consider safety in each action that they take. Before beginning any field procedure, employees are encouraged to complete our Hazard Identification Risk Analysis Program, known as HIRA, which comprises four key steps. The first step, is to pause before any task and ask questions of themselves and their supervisors to make sure they're prepared and qualified to complete the task. Next, employees mentally evaluate the procedure and ask, what can go wrong? This is known as consequence thinking. Step three is hazard management. Employees identify the physical, chemical, biological, and ergonomic hazards and evaluate how they can be reduced or eliminated. The final step, risk management, where employees consider the probability and potential severity of harm and damage resulting from a hazard that is present. Completing HIRA and implementing the necessary process improvements is what moves our team into the green zone. Simply stated, Working in the green zone results from continuous process improvements in reducing or eliminating risk factors. The Lane Christensen commitment to safety through green zone practices goes far beyond lip service. Incident free projects result in a bonus for all employees involved, not just management. We consistently pay safety bonuses that annually total hundreds of thousands of dollars to reward safe job practices. With job sites in Canada, Mexico, South America, Asia and Africa, we insist on the same standards and safe working conditions for all workers, both domestic and international. And rewarding green zone efforts makes a difference. No matter the country, the division, or the type of job, what sets us apart is our commitment to working in the green zone.
This working in the green zone culture flows beyond safety and training into all aspects of our company, particularly in the areas of sustainability and wellness. It drills down to the heart of the individual with our company-wide wellness initiatives aimed at enabling all of us to live better and perform our best. The Lane Christensen family of companies has a history of strict adherence to environmental regulations and is now actively engaged in developing global sustainability strategies. Preserving our planet's resources for generations to come is another way Lane Christensen is working in the green zone. While other companies just touch on safety, our commitment is demonstrated through our staff of safety professionals, collectively known as Lane Safety. This staff of international safety professionals routinely keeps our entire company on the cutting edge of safety operations and best practices for their specific job. These employees take their technical knowledge into the field where their practical experience pays off in safer practices and more secure sites. Job safety audits are anything but routine covering all safety aspects. For each of our thousands of customers, we consider regulation compliance a starting point. Lane has dozens of safety supervisors on staff whose job is to go beyond compliance to ensure that job sites are as safe as possible. Safety supervisors from Lane Safety review and evaluate more than 500 job sites annually for safe conditions and procedures in the U.S. and around the world. When it comes to being thorough, Lane Safety leaves no stone unturned during a job site audit. We perform industrial hygiene monitoring, highly detailed site inspections, air monitoring, noise testing, and check environmental operations and industrial sampling techniques. For many job, Customers request a lane safety supervisor to be present on the job site through the project. Whether it's water, energy, mineral, or geoconstruction, an experienced supervisor whose only job is reducing risk can be on hand to monitor worker safety. To further reinforce our Green Zone efforts, Lane Christensen also conducts rigorous annual training for every one of its thousands of employees across multiple divisions. We believe thorough training is the key to safer operations. A complete database is maintained at our corporate office for tracking the training and progress of all employees. If a customer needs specific training history information for any employee, we can provide it swiftly. In addition to company-wide training efforts, Lane Safety develops and implements job-specific training. All personnel involved in OSHA, MSHA, EPA, and DOT regulations are trained in-house by Lane Safety's Environmental Health and Sciences staff. Our clients can request that their employees receive training from Lane to ensure compliance with government regulations. For these efforts, many of our clients have recognized Lane with prestigious safety awards. The Lane Safety Team can also develop customized training modules to address the specific needs of our customers should a hazardous job situation present itself. This is just another way in Lane Safety strives to keep everyone working in the green zone. Lane Christensen operates on a global scale and employs thousands of people. Due to our international presence, we translate our material to several different languages. We believe that every employee should have the opportunity to read and understand programs in their native language. In addition to the programs, we provide monthly and periodic safety updates, training and newsletters in those languages, providing training and safety materials in multiple languages is another way we keep us all working in the green zone. Hi, 
I'm Fred Bonniewell, Director of Safety for Lane Christensen Company. Here at Lane, safety is our number one focus. We are working in the green zone. Our philosophy with safety is all accidents are preventable. Should an incident occur, we analyze these events to prevent reoccurrence, sharing the findings with all safety personnel and operational management. Because at the end of the day, there is nothing more important than our employees returning home to their families safe the same way they start each work day. Thank you, team. In addition to the efforts we've made working in the green zone, we also try to live in the green zone. We've implemented a company-wide wellness program that is focused on improving the health of all employees, their spouses, and children. Let me add how impressed I am with this team and their dedication to continual improvement. I'm proud of our working in the green zone efforts and expect to see even greater results. As we look towards a bright future, firmly planted in a tradition of excellence, Lane Christensen moves ahead with an industry leading emphasis on safe operations. In the US and around the world today, you'll find Lane Christensen employees, all working in the green zone.